Grain Pulse, a prominent enterprise in Mukono specializing in grains and animal feeds, showcased its range of products. The visit to Grain Pulse marked a pivotal moment for the company's future and its relationship with local farmers. We know in the grain sector that 70 percent of all farmers is basically smaller farmers that got less than one acre of our plot. So it's therefore very important that the farmers are profitable as well as sustainable in the long run. You can only do that if you make sure the farmers got the correct and high quality agri input materials such as seed, as fertilizer. And at Graples we've got our crop specific fertilizer that we supply to the farmer. It demonstrated its commitment to quality and innovation in its product line, which includes a variety of grains and specialized animal feeds. We are trying to get these technologies closer for them to understand that, yes. And we've also, as, as, um, as grain pulse, we are also introducing new fertilizers. We have organic fertilizers, we have organo minerals, whereby you have restoration of the soil, but also fertilization of the plant. So this is the, these are the technologies we are getting closer to the farmer. A key focus of the visit was to discuss strengthening of the partnership between grain pulse and local farmers who supply raw materials to the company. Investing in and excuse me and promoting Uganda's grain value chain development is the right thing to do because it touches and contributes to this secure, to this prosperous and to this healthy Uganda. It is the right thing to do because it contributes to economic development, it creates jobs and it improves livelihood opportunities for communities as we just heard from our colleagues who are working in the refugee hosting communities. The mission director emphasized the importance of this collaboration in fostering a sustainable agricultural ecosystem. We have new ways to store our products. The farmers have new ways of storing their products. They know how to handle their products when they take them out from the farms. But more importantly, we have organizations like Grain Pulse and, other, and others that uh, we are working with or supporting who are making sure that we can maximize value from those grains. And that's where the farmer is able to get most of their money. As Grain Pulse continued to innovate and collaborate, the support from USAID and the focus on ensuring farmer relationship are set to drive significant progress in the region's agricultural landscape. Lydia Chomkama and Juman Samba, UBC News.